comes with these puffy eyes. <laughs> and, um, excuse if I do this in monochrome, so I'm just gonna just get this out. Of here. Is it monochrome or monotone? <laughs> it's monochrome. It's, it's chromosomes. <laughs> Um, man, I am so overwhelmed with how much love and support I have in this room. First and foremost, I'd like to thank my Heavenly Father for watching over me and protecting me and being on my side even when I, um, even at times when I am undeserving of it. Um, for the past 21 years and for blessing me with all of you here today. I know my mom was hoping um, I wanted to travel for my birthday, but I thought, how often do I get the chance to throw a party and celebrate the people who have raised me? Um, every single person in this room has taught me something that has helped me mold me into the person I am today. Um, as I was preparing my speech, all I wanted to do was just thank everyone. So I decided to just say one thing I am grateful for. Um, for or one thing each family has taught me. So, we told us. Um, let me just tell you one thing. Growing up with my mom's siblings, it's like growing up with an Islander version of the Kardashians. Um, oh starring Wilma as um, Kim, 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 Kim K. <laughs> um, nah, but Nana Ems, thank you for my dramatic key. <laughs> Um, for spoiling me with love, making me feel special, and for doing above and for going above and beyond to make this world just that little bit warmer for me. For being my oof, goes, um, for being my personal seamstress, and for always trying to make sure my moral compass is always working, or in most cases just trying to um, repair my home. <laughs> um, Pawete, thank you for always trying to. Um, steer me in the right path and for starting every conversation we have with Asia make sure you go to school <laughs> I wake up Asia make sure you work hard at school having dinner make sure you graduate even at the most <laughs> randomest times like changing TV's nappy make sure you work hard at school Asia <laughs> nah but um pa you have instilled the value of education in me and the desire to not just be a pretty lady, but a smart lady. Fungavaka and Ruahis, you have taught me resilience, malaisalias, compassion, vagas, diligence, the tali juniors, um, kindness, kerasomas, um, to stop after three kids. No, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> that no matter how many times you fall, all you can do is just get back up. Nana, Sui and Pa Sol, although we have our language barriers, <laughs> there's still a strong connection. I thank you Nana Sui for always keeping my belly full and my heart warm. You always welcome me with open arms and a sincere smile, even though sometimes I rock up at your house at questionable hours of the night. Um, you watch over me from afar like an angel. Pa Solo, I thank you for giving me the skinny jean. <laughs> um, for, being, uh, for being an undisputable supporter of everything I do, for giving me, f uh, for making me feel like I have the liberty to live my life as I please, and for bringing our family together every Sunday for the past 21 years. The Eels from Odahu, um, you taught me unconditional love. But it was from Weymouth, goofy and usefulness, um, to evolve family, the value of consistency and keeping promises and devotion to our family and God. Some, some, some say it's obedience, play to ladies, to be nice to everyone you cross paths with, not because they are nice, but because you are nice. Well, nurses, um, you can't choose your family, no. <laughs> But, um, <laughs> um, but the families are forever. 
Robertson's um, until the there that sons can do it just as well. Um, table one, who's not even here? <laughs> um, well, y'all taught me how to party. Uh, Dunedin family, um, loving and embracing the imperfections of our youth days and our controversial decisions. <laughs> Table six, which is my readout friends, and wait, is that the right two? Yeah. Um, the value of a good friendship. Table seven, which is my mom and dad's squad, um, that a small circle is a good circle. Um, and last but not least, my amazing parents. <clears throat> Well, first of all, thanks for this epic party. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, can we just give them a round of applause? <laughs> um, um, words aren't even enough to express how proud I am to be your daughter. I haven't been watching enough scandal shows, these tears are dropping up. Um, um, words aren't even enough to express how proud I am to be a girl. I know we don't express our feelings as much as our like the families do. Um, but I am so proud of all of your achievements together. Look what God can do. From good old Sidey Garage <laughs> to France, back to another good old Zelda Garage <laughs> to owning our dream home. Looking back at the journey you have had, watching you to grow from teenagers with no idea to who you are now will forever be my favorite movie. Dad, I thank you for, for your understanding heart, your will for me to have all the happiness in the world, and for your prom and for your protection. You are the one reason I want to make the most proud, and you will always be my favorite man on this earth. <laughs> Mum, I thank you for your commitment to making me feel like a queen, for the freedom you gave me to express myself through fashion, for teaching me confidence and for just being the superwoman you are. You are my greatest and hardest critic, but my number one supporter. And my little Cleavy for inspiring me to be a better me. I'd like to just acknowledge um, some people that couldn't be. Oh, I'd just like to acknowledge all those who played a big part of my life, also that. Um, ooh, sorry, um, that aren't here with us um, today, but are here with us in spirit. My good old Uncle Carly and my gorgeous mama. I feel like it truly took a village to raise me, and I'm so genuinely overwhelmed with this celebration for me. Um, the reason why I wanted it takes a village was because it literally, like, that's just how I feel. Like. Um, you guys are my <laughs> and I am so proud to be, I'm so proud to be a Chinese Samoa, and I'm so proud to um, be from South Auckland, and I am so <laughs> proud of who I have become, and from all my family, all my friends, I just hope you guys have like a really cool night, and we all party like we all just turned 21. So, <laughs> so far to come here today. My Dunedin family, thank you very much. And my Auntie Kelly, Shaloa, Rocco, Auntie Schroeder, and Uncle Jerem, and um, little Prezi. Um, and yeah, thank you. It really does mean a lot, and I love you all so very much. I say these things, and they just come <laughs>